in Blackboard content, select Type Tool Reference, download it. In Illustrator, go to File, Place, and select Type Tool Reference, and click on your screen. You will use this image as reference. To create this first part, select the Rectangle tool, draw a rectangle, select the Ellipse tool, draw a circle starting at the center of the rectangle, hold down the Option key to draw the circle from center, and hold down the Shift key to constrain to a perfect circle. Draw the circle slightly larger than the rectangle. Let go of the mouse button before you let go of the Option and the Shift keys. Draw another concentric circle starting from the center of the previous circle. Hold down the Option key and the Shift key. Click and drag. This circle would be slightly smaller. Choose the Selection tool. Click on the rectangle, hold down the shift key, click on the larger circle, open up the pathfinder, select minus front, go to object, ungroup, click on empty space to deselect, click on the circle, go to object, arrange, bring to front, Click on the right shape, go to Object, Arrange, Bring to Front. To get dummy text, go to a browser, type in dummy text, go to dummy text generator, click and drag across the dummy text, copy, go back to Illustrator, choose the type tool, Hover over the edge of the left shape until the cursor changes from the square to a circle and click. And then go to edit and choose paste. If you want to change the size of the type, use the type tool, click anywhere inside the text. Go to select menu and choose all. Go to window and choose type character. You could change the size in here. Next, go to Window and choose Type Paragraph and choose Justify All Lines. Get the Selection tool, select all three shapes, go to Type, Threaded Text, Create. If you do not have enough text to fill the last shape, get the Type tool. Click anywhere on the text, go to Select All, Edit, Copy, click at the end of your text and go to Edit, Paste. Get the Direct Selection tool, click on Empty Space to deselect, click on the path of the circle, choose No Stroke and Fill with color. Get the selection tool, click anywhere on the text. In the paragraph palette, choose left indent. Five. And right indent. Five. Get the type tool. Click and drag to select the type that's inside the circle and change the black color to white. Get the selection tool, click on empty space to deselect. 